Hello everybody in YouTube. This is Mr. King Review and this is a brand new product from Old El Paso. It is the El Paso Chicken Burrito and it has salsa verde, seasoned chicken, rice, black beans, and cheese wrapped in a flour tortilla. Brand new. Looks pretty cool though. I'm wondering if it's going to look like that as I cut into it and see if I can see all of these flavors, all of the uh, black bean and everything. Now it says to take this in the microwave and um, cook it for unprecedented four minutes. This will be the first time I've had one that you cook for four minutes. So I'm, I'm really anxious to see how that comes out. It says four to six minutes uh, on high and then on low for six minutes. So anyway, um, you keep it wrapped, put it on the plate, cook it, then cut it open. So I'm going to get this in the microwave for four minutes. That's the only way really for you to cook it, no other instructions. So hopefully they know what they're doing and pass the test. And I'm gonna come back and let you know how it tastes, smell, and look. Well, I'm gonna even show you how it looks and um, give you my honest opinion and rating. Okay, YouTube family, I'm back. And yes, this is the largest frozen burrito I have ever had or ever seen. Now there's one larger, but it's in the refrigerated section of your stores, mostly uh, you can find them all the time in the QTs. They're about, I think they're by El Monterey or something, but they're very, very huge. You need to call them Mega or something. But anyway, they're so big you can share them with like two or three other people. Uh, as you can see, the filling is, is just bursting here. There, there just must be a ton of filling in there. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna give it my best to uh, take a bite of this, this huge thing and tell you what I think. Okay, pretty good. Um, burritos are, are always been one of my favorites. Um, you definitely can taste the the rice and the black beans, um, and there's actually some small pieces of corn in there too. Um, I didn't get any chicken. I don't think it's, it's just so huge. It's, it's working with a lot right now. Flavor's okay. Um, mm. Right now, it just doesn't stand out. Um, it's an okay burrito. It's definitely not bad. It's just not very flavorful. Put it that way. It could use a little bit more uh, flavorful but taste behind it or something. But um. Still, with that being said, I, I probably still would buy it again because I am I love burritos and black beans. You can definitely taste the black bean and the corn and the rice um, and probably step it up a little bit more on the chicken. Like I say, you know, it, it may even change as it gets down. I'm going to eat a little more and I'll leave a comment in this description. But for right now, on a scale of 1 to 10, uh, I'm going to give this one a uh, 7.5. It's pretty good. Um Sometimes you have burritos out there, you can't even tell what they're filling in. They'll tell you it's a beef and cheese, and you don't know what it is when you cook it. So, anyway, to the next video. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.